Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today we're gonna be doing a brand new series. It's Planet Coaster Tutorials. So basically, this is just me showing you how to tutorial. And it's probably not that interesting, but if you really want to know how to do some things, then go ahead and watch this video because watch this video because I'll be showing you. making sure the mic worked so today we're gonna be I'm gonna be showing you how to make um, a pretty pretty coaster that I think that is one of the best coasters one of the coasters that I really do like it's the American Arrow and so what this is and I'm gonna just turn it around. And we're gonna have it go up and that, you don't wanna have it go up as like the max, like 60, cause that's kind of weird. Even though that is pretty good. And, yeah, and you don't wanna keep it at four or lower. I usually keep mine at around eight. 10 or 8. Like this, and I want to keep testing this. But this high. And then you're going to want to aim it bigger. And then down. And here's what I do I don't go like straight down, backwards. I go about 50 degrees, 52 degrees. Down. And I usually go right into like a cobra roll. And this is just this is just showing what you could do with them. Oh, and I'm, I like to turn on baking offset. It's really helpful for certain things. Now this is where it gets kind of annoying. Like it won't let you. Can't auto tunnel it. These actually might be fairly shorter episodes than some of the other episode things that I've done. I might make uh, the queue and the station in another episode. So I'm going to right into a corkscrew, and you always want to watch. The fear was a little high there, so you're gonna want to get lower fear here. And what always works is if you do heartland rolls. Just go a little bit. right into it. And then you're gonna start bringing it back around into the stage. This is a fairly big ride, you know, so that 
it, you might want to make smaller rides because they tend to have a better ratio of people liking it for the reason that it's if you make one section really good and that's like the only section then it's gonna it'll be better it'll be better for you because people will only judge it by that sec it'll, you'll, it'll only be judged by like that section so here's a POV ride hopefully this isn't like a super bad ride and I just failed at everything I tried to explain to you and that's good thing because that means that there's some mistake we can learn from and I can tell you about that so you run over but so far it doesn't look like it's too too intense another thing is one spot is really good looking and it looks really fun except the nausea or fear mostly the fear though is kind of high like in this little section of the fear is super high then I'll just make a section where the fear is super low and that'll hopefully balance it out little bit. Oh no. This there's no way it's gonna make it over this loop. I know yep, nope. This is the point where I where I tell myself let's go redo that. Yeah, and this is where I can actually just put it in like a... Ooh, three meter auto tunnel? That's different. Wrap around corkscrew, and then back up. Turn auto, turn off, and auto complete it, and then bring it down. Hey, it's a pretty good coaster. So that was basically it's it's it was an okay coaster. So that's basically how to um, build the coasters. Um, and I'm gonna this is gonna be building and doing the terrain with your coaster. <laughs> terrain editing around your coaster. So there are some auto tunneling sections. You could either dig those out and make it like a trench sort of. Or you could, what I'm doing right here, you could just make it like this. Well, it looks like it's like a mountainous thing, and they'll never know the difference. And also, in but in a areas that like it wraps around a lot, make them like small, make it like a small pond, maybe. I don't know. Put it to good use. If it's an area that's used a lot, put something there. See? Now there's water there. We're gonna call this not a sea. Warp zone. Because I feel like it, and I'm gonna make the track color. Just black. Actually, let's see, what does that affect? Oh no, support's gotta be... Yes, there we go. 
Okay, that was uh, building and editing the terrain around building a coaster and editing the terrain around a coaster. If you guys want to see another Planet Coaster tutorial, then like the video. Subscribe, because that pushes me to do more. So, on this note, I will see you guys in the next video. BB. Buddy. See ya.